Uh, it's 6.39 and it's the first day of school for thousands of PHM students and their 1,500 staff members. Over 600 of those staff members are teachers at PHM. And I got the chance to speak with Dr. Jerry Thacker about what's being done to keep quality staff. Well, and I'm glad to say that we're fully staffed. So we're in great shape and we actually do, we do pay the highest in, in the area for a starting salary, but we've always focused on professional development. And we want to make sure that we have the teachers who are well prepared. We invest, in fact, this summer we've had a literacy summit. We work with teachers, we've worked with interventionists and looking at more data, ensuring that we can, can improve the success rates in every area. We want to have 100% of the students passing everything and have them well prepared for college and career success. But we have a focus on professional development. That even includes teacher evaluations. We look at teacher evaluation as a part of professional development. What about class sizes? Because when you're talking about a large student body and you're one of the largest school districts in our viewing area, how do you maintain the proper ratio of student to teacher? Well, we want to make sure that we're successful. So we have to have a, a, a great teacher-student ratio. We work with our teachers association and they're great to collaborate with and we, ha we set some standards. If we think that they need more support with interventionists and we actually put interventionists in every single school that we have and as we look into the future and we say the class sizes, we're starting a preschool for at Madison Elementary School for the southern part of the, of the school district and we'll make sure that all the participants are eligible for free lunch programs and we'll make sure that we we provide additional support for them with uh, we have summer school activities and we have extended we've extended our summer school expanded that over the last couple of years making sure that the students are successful the teachers are successful and Dr. Thacker gives a lot of credit to parents in the PHM district who stay involved in the school and student activities. He tells me PHM's iLearn test scores were ranked in the top 5% in the state, and their graduation rate is at 98%. We're